Okay, for anyone still listening, welcome back. Let's, let's just continue on from where we left off. Now, I've still got no views. I've still got no idea if it's actually going to go anywhere. But I'm going to continue with it nonetheless. Hmm. So yes, where we left off, we have... Few oyster farms. Let's just get this. How many people unemployed do we have? 14 with 34 open jobs. Let's just throw them. Let's just throw the fishing trawler out there. So here it is. There we go. That was to provide some nice. That was to provide some nice little, little income and plus food for people. Ideally, what we have to do is get get the high schools up and running, so we can start start producing graduates. So who hates me? Communists, of course. So persecute those damn communists. Healthcare is next on the list. And yes, that's all in, in order. That's the trouble when you upload the same game game over several week, weeks. I just don't remember what my fort train was. And also my dynasty members are probably all messed up. Long. Unfortunately, we can't do that because we need to wait until graduates appear. So, what do we need for run this to We need we need educated citizens for that too. some buildings like the farmers fair and that all seems in order like this yeah we can upgrade that set some managers. No, we haven't. Paid ads. And yellow press. Oh. Presidente, my friend the fish guy, he's so Funny. He told me that he wants lots of fish to awaken his master from his thousand year stupor. Uh. Well, okay then. Well then. Please, what's with all these new people coming in? What industry can we build that doesn't require not much to be honest? Wouldn't. 
We've got graduates coming out. Maybe we can just build some, build a couple of build a couple of pharmacies or clinics, as they're properly known as. I could be where to put them. Let's put one around here. <laughs> this really slowed down, huh? It's all really, really slowed down, and I've forgotten where the clinic was. And it was on the welfare. And just put it here. Riveting gameplay. Riveting. Well, since we seem to be stuck in a loop just waiting for them. What else can we build? Why do we need clinics? Just grow a pair, people. I once had a whole sea urchin stuck in my foot. But did I go to clinic? No. Then, when an overfriendly llama attacked me while I was removing the urchin and I had to fight it off, did I go to clinic like a crybaby? No. And when I finally had to run across the entire island after the llama came back with his friends in stilettos? No. I just went to my secret rum stash and drank it all. Like old Tropicans should, instead of going to a clinic like a bunch of pansies. That build a second clinic over here. And a church. There we go. That should That should quell some of the uh, that should quell the decreasing happiness. But yeah. I think there is a very serious problem going on right now with a uh, lack of education. But then it's a, it was going to be a bumpy road anyway as soon as we left the colonial era. Once we get enough, enough educated people about, then things will start running smoothly again. Where's the f all the fish gone? Certainly taking your time.
Maybe there's a literacy program. Yeah. Well, one thing's a fact. Our, our clinics have done a wonderful jo job keeping keeping the uh, happiness under control. Simply by virtue of them having <laughs> having been able to cover all the people in their island with, with healthcare. There's a dynasty member just chilling out by the newspaper. Community A's. Please help and quality of increase by twenty five percent. Okay. That fish helper is just going up and up. Maybe it's a good. Uh, it'll be a good idea if I put um, put another salmon around here. Oh jeez. This is like, well, it feels kind of like the Great Depression to be honest. Because this is very, very depressing what is happening right now. Nothing is happening. I'm just running the country. Everything is going as smoothly as it could, can be and I don't even have any rebels to fight. It's just one great big city builder. Let's build a road that goes over here. There. Just so we are prepared, prepared for the future. Maybe if we build an observatory, but then for that we're going to need a college, and the college will provide its own unique grand problems. And besides, we need edu we need educated workers. Why is our population? Homeless families. Let's build some houses, shall we? Right. You two here. You look like you could use a country home. There's a house over there that those guys can simply move into. I don't. And down here. He's simply unemployed. Although he clearly is not unemployed. Although isn't. What's next? Mr. President, your aide Penultimo was hit by a falling brick seven times. Now he thinks he is a superhero 
and that you are his sidekick. You know what? If it gives me something to do. Let's build this asylum, shall we? So where would be a good place to put it? I wanted to put it all the way over there, but I had better, had other thoughts. May have to though. There we go. What exactly does it need? It needs college workers. If this carries on, we're going to have to build a college. Let's also build a restaurant. to build another country house to accommodate that. And I think that and I think that this asylum will benefit with a mansion because the doctors are gonna be living in there. They're gonna be a very rich bunch. Psychiatrists and all that. So yeah. So what an asylum basically does is that last time I checked, it it provides a basic level of healthcare to the entire island. It doesn't. You don't have it, the people of Tropico doesn't have to visit it. They just have to have an asylum on the islands. Another thing we did is that we built this restaurant. Now restaurants have been usually buff buff thanks to the oyster farms, which can be which can supply local markets to therefore increase the effectiveness of all restaurants. Yeah. Mr President, the doctors have concluded that Pinotimo suffers from a multiple personality disorder. Personally, I am shocked that Penultimo has any personality at all. Mm -hmm. So. President, Tropicans await elections next year. They wish to show their everlasting love and respect for you. They may have used different words, but that does not matter. One, three, four, five, six, seven. Whitney. Time to show the other world leaders who is the best Presidente. Let us wave something in their faces, something big and impressive. 
Yeah, let's do that. Turns out we needed one anyway. Wow. Where would be a good place to put it? That overwall thing, thing is going to get really old really fast. to put it there but it just feels not doesn't feel right. Yeah. Right there ought to be good. And the house. There we go. So next on the line is let's just upgrade these oyster farms. Presidente, I hereby with two four require you on the habeas cojones to execute a writ with a novation decreeing a peres to one penultimo, hereby referred to as the penultimate party. Should you fail to comply, you shall thereby to four be nounced as a tortfeasor, and the tropical people shall be taught the language of legalese. Right, okay, man. So, please stay and... What is paradise and visa program? There we go. What next? White flag. That that was to do nicely. Our economy seems to be doing fine. We may need the need few new docks in the future, but for now we're just getting everything sorted. And graduates, no, it's still going on pretty slowly. But at least we've got, but at least we're filling out all of Edica's positions now. Save the city from the evil crime lords. To the monorail Catmobile, yarn boy. What the hell? Okay, then. I can see Tropico is becoming the tropical paradise it is supposed to be. More and more people are abandoning the hustle and bustle of city life to settle in shacks and live as one with nature. Right on, people. The beach is big enough for everyone, and my bar works 24-7 to satisfy all your worldly needs. 
I'm so glad that we got the visa program up and running. Bluetooth in there, and more of the same, more of the same. And that should increase. That should increase it quite rapidly. How about another restaurant? Where's the put them? Where's the put this second restaurant? There, there seems quite nice. Right next to the insane asylum. So I may as well not build another one. Thousand fish ready to be exported. Presidente, I'm shaking. You're shaking. Everyone is shaking. Oh, great. This is all I need. This is all I need. There goes a the country house, an inquisition, one of her mansions, one, another one of her mansions, another one of the country houses. The earthquake is over. We made it. I am now going to rethink my life and the choices I have made. Done. Now, let's evaluate the damage. I've already kept track of everything. Repair all. Rebuild all. There we go. But it's not... It hasn't, it hasn't done too much damage. It's just been a major inconvenience. How's the happiness coming along? Healthcare has dropped like a rock. Entertainment is slowly going up. We have an opportunity to influence the outcome of coming elections. Uh, strictly speaking, this is not considered exactly legal, but I guarantee that no one will find out. Yeah, we can get do without cheating. It will, it will give a regime some more credibility. That is has sent me money. And building permits sent me a nice two, 20, 10 thousand. There goes Whitney. We would. <laughs> the election results are in. Let me be the first to congratulate you, Presidente. Okay then. Let's start up a, sec a second settlement over here. There we go. And build. Build that. So what this other settlement is going to be is be... It's going to bring, bring the fishing trawler a little bit closer. But 
They also allow us to start up our industry because it's starting to get a little bit too crowded over here. But anyway, that's about that's about 30 minutes. I hope you enjoyed it because I know I haven't, and I'm pretty sure you guys haven't either. But just in case, when if anyone does have to happen to be watching this, anyone at all, please let me know if I can continue because I'm all for switching games at this point. So thank thank you for watching. And, and goodbye.